All righty, welcome to the first Cardinal Happy Hour here at Conrad's for the month of May. Men's tennis here beside me, head coach Ben Ford, and then first team all-conference Ugnius Biskauskas. Did I get that right, Ug? Yeah. All right, hey, congratulations good. on the honors. Thank you. We'll lead off, Ben. Your first year here as the head coach for the men and women tennis programs. Talk a little bit about how that transition was and how you thought the season went. Well, I I had no idea what I was getting involved in and, uh, when I started September 1st. I'll never forget the first practice. I walked out there. I had no idea of what I was getting into. And uh, after about 15 minutes, I brought everybody together, and I went, wow, I've got some real athletes here because I can't teach someone to be an athlete. So uh, from a coaching standpoint, that, was, uh, that made my job a lot easier. And uh, we just jumped right in the fire. We had a, we had a, a match within 10 days, and we just got after it. And uh, the team uh, maybe, you know, it took a little while to, to get used to my style because I'm, I'm more of a technical coach rather than a, a, a trainer type coach. And uh, they all seemed to take to it. And uh, I compared and contrasted today our, our matches that we played this year to last year. And they all made 20%, 30% improvement, including Ugnus here that uh, he got to the quarterfinals of, uh, of a national tournament, beat two top 10 players in the country. And uh, he also uh, had two other wins over top 10 players in the country. So next year he'll, he should be an All-American or I should be fired. <laughs> Ooh, talk a little bit what it was like for you. You come and you have the success last year, and then you continue to have some of that sustained success this year, the wins over top 10 opponents, top break schools. Tell me a little bit about that. So, yeah, I mean, it was uh, not an easy transition, I feel, because we had, like, you know, Doug last year, and he left. So I feel it like when Ben came, I, th I thought it was going to be, like, you know, hard transition. But, I mean, overall, it was really easy and smoothly. Ben took it, like, really well. And uh, starting from the first week, we kind of – uh, yeah, I mean, went to Nationals like in 10 days after the season started. I mean, that was something that uh, Ben added a lot to me, to, to my game, in like short period of time because it was, he explained it so well and like we went through through this process and we still continue to improving. So I'm definitely confident about next year and uh, waiting for, for the next season to, you know, to come. And confident as you should be. I mean, w one other know. thing on that, I, I noticed that there's a huge wall of all Americans in, in the hallway there at the maybe center. And I, I noticed that uh, Jay Lynn told me that there was a two or three girls that were on there. And I thought, well, we've got to get our first guy on there. And I think this is, we're going to start with this one right here. Ended the season on a good note too, with two back-to-back -back wins there to close everything out. Good, yeah. Good way to great. end it. That was great. Right. Uh, no one told me how good our conference was uh, when I started. Gee, many Christmas. Oh, yeah. But I mean, we have one yeah. of the strongest in the nation. I mean, D2. It's Jones either one or two, tennis. right? Yeah, it's, it's yeah. one of the best ones. So it's competitive. How do you guys like that, knowing that every week that you guys are playing, it's going to be against good competition come that conference schedule? It makes practice really interesting, doesn't it? Uve? Oh, I yeah, mean, for yeah, sure. Yeah. I mean, we have, to get, we have to get after it. We have to get after it to get better because these teams are, are, are amazing. Um, I would, I think, seven out of the ten are nationally ranked. Yeah, so that's a lot. Let's go. <laughs> I got to go to a, one of your matches earlier in the year against Northwest Missouri State, and yeah. everyone was calling you the captain, the captain. What does it mean when you hear that, just with the stature and the success that you've had, knowing your teammates look up to you? So, I mean, definitely means a lot because, I mean, when I play in matches, it's not only about me, but it's also about my teammates. I have to, like, show a good example. I have to lead the team. And it's really important how I behave and act on the court, even though there were some instances I wasn't really proud of. But overall, I try to really look to the team because I think the impact I give on the court, it's like huge. And they definitely look up to me. I mean, I mean I'm not trying to, you know, uh, prove something, or but I'm trying to be myself and show that, you know, you just have to go and play. And the results will come if you just keep, I don't know, confidence and consistency in your game. So... If, if anybody has ever walked by our courts, I know everybody, the soccer and the, the track people and the football people walk by our courts when we're practicing, and, and you'll hear something like a big whack. So guess what his nickname is? Big whack, Ugnus Bitskakis. 
Big whack I mean, Miss I mean, it really. I mean, you can hear it. You can hear it. Everybody on the football field turns around and says, you know, where's, what, what, what's that? And what's Big Whack? Yeah, he's killing it. Right. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. He's humble. <laughs> what has it meant to you, Ben, to be able to come in here? You have, you know, one year under your belt, and then next season you're returning a majority of your roster, correct me if I'm wrong, only two between the men and the women losing to graduation? Right, right. It's, uh, yeah, next year, in fact, I'm, I've already worked on the, on our, our first week practice. <laughs> I know what we're working on the first week. And uh, we, we have several sayings. One is, is uh, good players don't miss. So, uh, you know, we're, we're giving them homework over the summertime and they're going to come back with certain, you know, uh, ideas of, of what we want conditioning wise and, and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, next year should be, should be the, uh, a great year for, uh, Cardinal tennis. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. No yeah. doubt. Yeah. Looking forward to watching yeah. you guys, watching the women and seeing you on the court. All right. Yeah, great. Awesome. Appreciate Ooh. it. All right. Yeah. Congratulations Thanks, again, Oog. Thank Greg. you. Thanks, awesome. Greg. Appreciate Thank, it. Yep. Thanks for coming to Cardinal Happy Hour at Conrad. Stay tuned. We got powerlifting, men's lacrosse, and our basketball championship celebration coming up.